What is going on guys? Welcome to Tom Clancy's The Division. It's been a little while since we've uploaded again, um, which seems to be a recurring pattern with me right now. But we've got the um, The Division 1.3 update, which literally just came out 20 minutes ago. Um, I'm 20 minutes late to the party, but uh, set up for recording and everything, and uh, that took 20 minutes. And plus I had to have something to eat and drink, so let's get right into this, shall we? Right. So, in the new update, um, we've got uh, new gear sets, new weapons, and uh, we've got new mission modes, and then we've got a new fast travel thing to do with the base of operations. So, that's a quick overview. Um, if um, What I'm going to do is, this is a new, slightly different way of me making videos. I hope you guys enjoy. If you do like it, give me a comment. Uh, tell me if I can change anything. Um, I am going to be cutting backwards and forwards. Um, also, I've changed up the way I'm slightly recording these differently. Um, so, yeah, um, tell me if the quality or my voice sounds better or anything sounds better at all. Let me know, because uh, it would be nice for, for that information. So, anyway, to new gear sets, we've got um, five new gear sets, is that right? One, two, three, four, yeah, five new gear sets. Um, this doesn't really tell you a lot about them, but oh well. Um, so, we've got new weapons, we've got nine new weapon types, we've got the Military G36 Assault Rifle, we've got the G36C Assault Rifle, we've got the G36, um, more Assault Rifles really pretty much, um, we've got the SVD, um, Marksman Rifle and uh, stuff like that, we've got a few other nice weapons, we're going to try and get some of those hopefully today. Um, which, well, I'll look into and see what we can do. I don't really know much about... So, I haven't even gone past the screen yet, so uh, I don't know what's happening after this. Uh, also, we've got um, new missions. Um, we've got a new mission... Uh, uh, two new mission difficulties, apparently. Um, for Hudson uh, Refuge and Queen's Tunnel. Sounds pretty cool. Also, we can get some new things from other missions and stuff like that. It tells you all about it there. If you want to pause, you can and read it. That or all. The patch notes will probably be online somewhere if anybody else wants to look. Um, we've also got um, uh, the tunnels and stuff like that. The underground expansion, I'm, I'm guessing that is, I think. Um, I'm not sure I haven't really read through all of these. Um, I'm just going to go and jump straight into it. And also, then you got like the full patch notes, which is uh, there. Go ahead and pause, and you can read it all if you really want to. And, uh, yeah. And then we'll jump straight into it once uh, I've scrolled down this a little bit it's more. Just in case you guys who want to actually pause and read it can. Stop there for a second, there we go, and a little bit more, and there we go. Alright, so guys, if you want to go read that, you can, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit continue, and let's go jump right in. Um, so I know there's a few changed, uh, things changed in the base of operations, apparently. Um, I don't know what else is new, um, I'm probably going to get like 120 pop-ups here telling me what's new and everything. Um, but we'll uh, we'll learn that all together. Hopefully, anyway. I just need to turn my volume up because my volume is way too low, and that's now fixed. Rightio. Just gotta wait until we uh, load in. The servers are only being up for 20 minutes as of right now. Well, 24 minutes. It's um. If you want to know, as of right now, of me recording this, it is uh, Tuesday the 28th at uh, 11.24 a.m. And that is um, um, BST, which is uh, British Summer Time. GMT, I think, is an hour behind, I think. So Agent, we got a like... call from the commander of the Secure Quarantine Center over in the Tenderloin. It's where the JTF screened civilians for access to Camp Hudson and to work with the relief effort. We got 80 people housed there. He needs some help when you get a chance. Oh, sweet. So it looks like what we've got is we've got a new incursion. I wasn't expecting a, a quite literal incursion. But, uh... Oh, okie dokie then. Oh, wow. This one's actually in the middle um, as well. So let's uh, go into all. 
So this is the new incursion right here. Wait to put my feet up and take a break. This patrol has been brutal. You said it, man. Wait. Alright, so what we're going to do is I'm actually going to later on and actually do the incursion. Because um, I don't know how long that is actually going to take to actually record because incursions tend to take forever. But um, what we're going to do, I think, today is... Uh, hold on, this one's got a circle around it. Does that mean... Yeah, that is just quite literally, I think. Right, so what we're going to do is we're actually going to head over here and see what this new mission is. Um, it's new. Agent, so. I need you to check in with Commander Hector at the Secure Quarantine Center in the Tenderloin. We got 80 civilians in there, but one of them's missing. Looks like they were building an IED. I could use your eyes on the investigation. Right, first things first, I forgot. Things have changed in the Bisphop versions. Why we're here? Why not go check it out? So we're going to slowly go in here and um, see what's new. I know there's something new near the weapons claim vendor, I think he's called. And also we'll check to make sure we're Cuts fully stocked yards. here. Didn't go up in smoke, thanks to you. So, there's something new down here. Oh, whoa, hello. This wasn't it. Wow, okay, the weapons claim vendor was right here. Oh, he's not. He's over here. Okay, that's uh, that's new. Oh, and then... Wow. Okay. <laughs> and then you've got to walk down these steps this quickly. God damn, this is going to take forever. Okay, why are we walking this slow? Like, come on, man. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, so this is like the way in and out. This is. Oh, hello. There's people down here. Oh, that's cool. So, okay, so we've got like new people down here. Okay, so this is like another social area. Like, a. Oh, this is cool. So there's a stash here. What else is here? There's music there. Hopefully I don't get copyrights, right? That wouldn't be very nice if that happened. Oh, so what's over here then? Okay. Offline. Acquires DLC. Purchase DLC. Oh. I think I might actually have that DLC. I just haven't maybe downloaded it, maybe? I don't know. Um, what we're going to do is we're going to go over and do that mission and then what I will do is um, after we've experienced this a little bit more, by the way this is all legit, um, this is my first reactions to it, I've never even done this before, um, there might be DLC what I might need to go download which I will have a look at. Um, once we've done this we'll do a quick little episode here and then what we'll do is I will go check for, um, for DLC and stuff and then uh, we will jump right back into this and then we'll I'm, I'm also going to try and do the incursion today hopefully the incursion is a little bit easier than previous incursions wow this this has really changed it's weird we've changed where where the weapons claim vendor is as well it's uh it's different but i think they need to um fix the way that back door is to be highly honest with you right so what we'll do is we'll run over here and do this mission and see what there is and uh, I think this is a continuation with the main story I think. I think that's cool if they are actually going to expand the story and stuff like that. Do it via DLC and then hopefully at some point it might come to an end. Hey, oh we can help this guy. I, really appreciate the help. I don't know what I gave you but okay there you go thank you mate. <laughs> If you're wondering what else is in my backpack, um, I always carry an SMG as well. So as you can see, I'm using my AUG, and then I have my um, rifle, and then I also have um, an SMG in my backpack, just in case, because we tend to run out of... Um... Oh, okay, these guys are level 30 now. I don't think these guys were level 30. <coughs> Sorry. I've got a uh, bit of the hiccups going on as well, which is not very good. Right, we're really close, so. Let's go see. Plus, I'm full of energy as well. It's the morning time, so. I've got plenty of energy and plenty of things to talk about since we haven't actually recorded in a while. Which, uh. uh well, when I tend to record a lot, I tend to get a bit boring. 
<laughs> but uh, when I haven't recorded in a while, I'm a little bit more like, yes, come on, let's record something and uh, get on with it. And I'm a little bit more entertaining. But uh, if you want to know what things have happened in between uh, our last recording, um, as of, well, well um, England is no longer in the EU. Uh, that's a new thing. Uh, which I think is good if you guys want to know. But uh, let's uh, go on with this mission. Captain Benitez, shit, we found an IED. It's in a sub basin, some tunnel. We think it's how she got out. Sure, all personal belongings are clearly labeled. Oh shit! I think this thing's gonna. Whoa! Agent, agent, are you okay? Agent, get anyone you can out of the building. Got it. Oh Jesus! Holy shit! Oh God, we had eighty people in there. Holy Christ! Quarantine center, you have Rikers incoming! I'm seeing a gang of Rikers well armed coming right at you! This is no goddamn coincidence. Watch your back out there! Yeah, no coincidence. Oh, okay, there we go. We got a nice purple there already. Wow, okay. Whoa, hello. Kind of shooting for the wind, but they seem to come back and biting us in the ass. Oh, okay, hello. Rikers, time to break out the new toy. Well, he seems to be going down pretty quickly with the gun while I've got right now, so. He's down. He went down real quick. God damn. I wasn't expecting them to go down that quick. These guys are dying really quick. God damn it. Agent, we need to get a handle on what the hell's going on. See if you can find anything on any of those Rikers. Got it. Say we got something here. Analyzing smartphone data. GPS data identified. Fucking smartphones. Even though you can't make calls, a lot of people still carry them around. Road's got a lot of cell towers back online. Maybe there's something useful here. Get that phone back to the base of operations, Agent. Maybe Rhodes can dig something useful out of it. He's been putting together a rig for tactical intel analysis. It's about time we use it. Damn it. We've been hitting the Rikers pretty hard and the other factions, too. I knew one of them would hit back at us, I just... I thought we'd see them coming. So, okay, that's, um... Huh. Holy shit. Uh, I think this is actually the first time they've ever put, like, uh, like another, like, extension, like, mission on like this. As far as uh, I'm aware, anyway. I don't think... I don't think... Oh, no, they didn't, no. I was just thinking, like, the last episode we did of the main story was that Mebby's one, but, like, then I thought about it and I was like, no. That was, um, that was after we did, um, the last main mission. Give my kit, yeah, you can give your makeup. They seem to be giving more, more crap now these days. Actually, I'm just going to quickly see what we got from that, uh, from that missile. Oh, hello! It's now got uh, different in here now a little bit. Okay, that's uh, that's cool. That's cool. Oh. Huh. Hmm. Uh, has these changed anything? No. Okay. Well, uh, we'll go back to. I think we're going back to the base of operations right now. 
Um, I could just fast travel, but um, I don't know. I, I don't really want to fast travel. When you fast travel, it tends to get a bit boring. And plus, then you don't get me just, you know, sitting there doing nothing. I can actually kill people and tend to get more loot, which is uh, always fun. But uh, the, when you actually have the people out in the street, they uh, they don't give you as much good stuff as what they used to give. I don't think, anyway. But that's just recently. I haven't really got anything good since I think the last update. But uh, if you like these type of videos as well, like I'm probably going to be putting out a couple today. Over the next couple of days, there'll definitely be one or two out. So I'm guessing... I'm going to take this inside of the base of operations. And the door is just here. In we go. Yeah, I was just about to say, the base of operations is 100% complete. Alright, so we might need to go give this to somebody. Looks like we might have to go down the back here and give it to them. Best of luck. Yeah, it looks like we're going to. You know you want Terminal. Down the slow stairs, so we uh just a little bit earlier we actually came down here. Watch yourself but, out there, uh, agent. Where the hell was she? Slowly walk. And plus these videos might not be too long as well, but uh I'll try and make them as long as possible. So Agent, good. Report to the Tactical Operations Center. Rhodes has been fitting up. Oh, okay. So, right guys, I'm actually going to end this here because I'm probably going to have to go download some DLC. Which, uh, which I'll go check to see if I've got. And, uh, we'll download it or whatever. I have the season pass, so it shouldn't cost any money, hopefully. But, uh, <laughs> that's a nice way to actually get people to buy the DLC as well. Like, I so, said, oh yeah, here's a mission for you guys. But you have to have the DLC too. So anyway, guys, what I'm going to do is I'm going to come back in the next episode. And the underground section of this um, with the DLC. So thank you guys so much for watching. I will catch you guys in the next video which should be coming out later today or very early tomorrow and maybe tomorrow we might have two episodes today might just be this one it just depends on how I edit and render these videos so anyway guys thank you so much for watching if you like the video give it a like subscribe for more content and also you'll be notified when so anyway guys thank you so much for watching peace guys